For school, I had to present a report on a species of birds. I chose eagles because they're fierce predators that rise above the competition and swoop down and take what they want, like me. Furthermore, we live on a mountain. Now and then, we can see an eagle circling around the sky, a perfect opportunity for observational science. According to my research, eagles love to eat birds, lizards, mice, and other small animals. In fact, they've even been known to carry away dogs. This got me thinking. Our dog, Dogalina, is so heavy, I can't even pick her up. And I lift weights. So if an eagle were able to carry away a big heavy thing like her, then why not me? As soon as I had this exciting realization, I ran outside and waved my arms. I even saw the eagle, but she wasn't interested. I happen to know that eagles especially love to eat rabbits. So I put on some bunny ears and hopped up and down. That caught her attention. But then I remembered, eagles are also known to carry their prey way up high and drop them to their deaths. This made me slightly nervous, so I did the logical thing and played dead. Moments later, the eagle swooped down, clutched me in her talons, and whisked me into the sky. It was neat. And I must have been a pretty good actress because he didn't drop me to my death. I still tried to play dead, but then my rabbit ears fell off and the dig was up. The eagle screeched her consternation of being duped. I, being well educated in eagleology, screeched back. <coughs> For those of you who aren't familiar with the eagle language, that means, I'm sorry to have deceived you, but I felt it necessary to conduct a proper interview. I'm doing a report on eagles, you see, and I'd like to ask a few questions. The eagle was flattered. She said that she'd always wanted to be interviewed. She showed me her eggs and her rabbit skulls. I asked if it was true that eagles push their babies out of nests to teach them how to fly. It is, replied the eagle. Would you like me to do it to you so you can learn to fly? I don't think that would work, I said because I don't have wings. Oh, it's not wings that make you fly, said the eagle. It's the eagle diet. Just eat a few bites of this rabbit carcass and you'll be able to fly. I'm pretty sure I need wings to fly. What do you know about flying? I'm an eagle. I decided that the eagle had a point, so I ate some of the rabbit carcass. <coughs> it was awful. Then I stood at the edge of the nest and the eagle pushed me off. It was really scary. I flapped my arms, I tried to think happy thoughts, but I just couldn't fly. Luckily, there were some springy trees to pad my fall, though not without some scrapes and bruises. The eagle met me at the bottom. That was some excellent flying, she said. I just fell, I said. Oh no, you're definitely flying. I'm pretty sure I didn't fly. What do you know about flying? I'm an eagle. I decided that eagles aren't very smart. Can you take me home now? Maybe next time we can play at your house. I'll keep that in mind.